We had a pretty fun morning. We went for sunrise and even though the clouds weren't too great, we still had a great time hanging out with the boys. We're here in Permagui. We just got back, we had a nice breakfast. We're now prepping to get ready for a seal snorkeling trip. So as you can see, there's quite a bit of gear uh, involved that we will be taking along to hopefully get some really cool footage of seals in the wild. So we're driving along this beautiful, beautiful bush road, like this is just so stunning in our van and Rob pumps the brakes and says, there's a turtle! We almost ran over this little guy who's right in the middle of the, where the, where the wheels go. So he's kind of, um, he's alive, but he's tucked in. So we're gonna, we're gonna save him. I feel like that's the right thing to do. Careful. Sorry, buddy. I usually need to use. Yeah, look. How is oh, he? he's leaking stuff. Ah. There we go, little man. In the shed. That's nice cool. Bro, that's heavy. <laughs> Good job. Take some trash out. How old do you reckon that is? Oh, something smells. Oh, God. This bottle could be a winner. Hello gang, welcome back to Sydney, welcome back to Australia. It is so good to be back here. I want to talk tech for a little bit. This is the Asus ZenBook Duo. The Duo stands for the two screens that it has, which is innov innovative, innovative? I never know how to say this word, but it's got two screens, they're both full HD, they're both 100% Pantone validated, which is pretty much you get great colors, which is important if you're a photographer or a videographer such as myself. The bottom screen is a touch screen and it also works with this active stylus pen which allows you to do local edits in Photoshop or in Lightroom for example if you're retouching some imagery. Inside this little beast I have a 10th generation i7 processor which means it's really fast and really efficient at exporting for example a sequence of raw photos into a video file from After Effects or just exporting photos from Lightroom to JPEGs to upload to your Facebook or Instagram or Twitter. 
it's really quite fast and efficient. The bottom screen, which by the way is called the ScreenPad Plus, has a sort of a quick launch system with which you can customize which apps you launch at the touch of a button. For example, if I wanna just launch my Spotify and my uh, Twitter feed or whatever, you can do that with one touch. It's all fully customizable. You can use the draw stuff to put signatures on documents, all this uh, interesting things, interesting things, all this interesting stuff that you can do with that bottom screen. I have really been enjoying this laptop. I've been editing on it for the last couple of weeks. It's small, it's more lightweight than my other laptop, and I really enjoy it. If you have any questions about it, please drop them in the comments down below so I can get back to you. Thank you for watching. Thank you, Asus, for sponsoring this video, and I will hopefully see you guys on the next one. Goodbye.